All right, the Cleveland Browns and hard knocks. I mean, this is one of those things that the team actually has been trying to stay away from for several years, and now I really believe the NFL has you know, put some pressure on them to be on that HBO special that takes you behind the scenes and shows you everything that's going on. And really, if you are looking at this from the outside, like the, uh, uh, I'm, I'm sure like the network is, like HBO is, they're saying, uh, think about this. The football, here we go. The Browns say there's no quarterback controversy. Of course there will be one. If not, we want to make sure we can kind of build it up. Baker Mayfield, the number one pick. Tyrod Taylor coming in. So you have that right there. One quarterback versus the other. They love that stuff. Secondly, Hugh Jackson won one game in the last two years. Can he hang on to his job? How is this going to work? New general manager John Dorsey inherited uh, Jackson. I mean, you could just, all these things that they will build up. Another one, for example, Hugh Jackson and Todd Haley, the new offensive coordinator. Will Hugh Jackson allow Todd Haley to really call plays? Will Todd Haley get mad at Hugh Jackson? Will they all get mad at Baker Bayfield? On and on it will go. You, know, you can even go into some subplots from there. You know, Denzel Ward, the local kid from Nordonia High School, Ohio State. Can he start? How, the pressure of playing at home. That, actually, Denzel Ward's a very interesting story to me just in general because of that. I really like that selection. But should they have taken Bradley Chubb from North Carolina State? Most draft experts said they should have. Did the Browns mess up again? You, we could just go, you know, all kinds of different things there. But So it's going to be on. Hard knocks. It'll be interesting. I'm sure they'll go in the defensive room and they'll catch Greg, Will Greg Williams, the defensive coordinator, just ripping into someone because that's what Greg Williams does. Uh, I just hope it's one of those things where it comes out and the Browns don't embarrass themselves again. My guess is they probably won't because usually uh, the NFL is, is careful in how they portray these things. And a lot of stuff that would make a franchise look really bad, I think, ends up on the cutting room floor. They wouldn't continue to get the access. But you want drama, they will give you drama, even if they have to look everywhere under every locker, under every little football, everything else, and it will start with the quarterback controversy, whether there is one or not.